Parliamentary inquiry. Please take your inquiry. Um, I, am I correct that we just heard the uh, governor's proclamation? Uh, there was a lot of noise in the chamber, so I wasn't quite sure what Mr. Haney was reading, but is, is that what we just heard? The clerk did read the proclamation. Yes, Great. Sir. Thank you. Um, the parliamentary inquiry, Mr. Speaker. And please state your inquiry. So is, am I correct that Article 4, Section 8 of the Texas Constitution permits the governor to convene the legislature for an extraordinary session uh, and uh, the proclamation, therefore, shall state specifically the purpose for which the legislature is convened? Your statement is correct, and we're not certain the article you refer to is correct. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Um, parliamentary inquiry. Please state your inquiry. Uh, the governor's proclamation that we just heard uh, does include several items related to appropriations. Is that correct? That is correct. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Speaker, parliamentary inquiry. Please state your inquiry. Is, uh, was funding for Article 1 of the state budget one of the appropriations related items in the governor's proclamation? Mr. Turner, I do not believe Article 1 was addressed. Thank you. Uh, and last inquiry, Mr. Speaker. Uh, during the special session, <clears throat> is it within the purview of the legislature as we address appropriations-related items on the governor's call, would it be uh, within the legislature's purview to reappropriate funds from Article 1, including the governor's office, to other items in the state budget? Mr. Turner, that is a hypothetical question. The chair respectfully declines the comment. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Thank you, Mr. Turner.